Hi, my name is Diane Schuster, and I'm going to explain the Cozy Rock licensing model for you in this video. It is explained on our website, but I just want to make sure everything is clear before you make your purchasing decision. The Cozy Rock suite includes many components and tasks, and we have a repository of scripts that anyone can contribute to, and the scripts are all available to you for free. We have two types of licenses. There's the Ultimate Subscription and the Perpetual License, and both types of licenses include the Complete Suite. First, before I go into the specific types of licenses that we offer, I want to make it clear that you only need one license key per physical machine. Doesn't matter how many virtual machines you have, or how many CPUs, or how many users of certain applications. You just need one license key per physical machine. Another point I want to make is that you only need to purchase a license key once you are scheduling and executing your packages under the SQL Job Agent. You don't need a license key to develop or test, and you also don't need a license key for a one-time migration. If you have clusters with active and passive nodes, you're probably wondering how the licensing works for that situation. You'll need to deploy a license key on both the active and the passive nodes. However, you're only going to need to pay for a key for the active nodes. And you'll need to contact Cozy Rock, and I suggest using sales at CozyRock.com, and we'll allocate additional slots for your passive nodes. And by the way, this applies to both the ultimate subscription and the perpetual license. 